think when we did that series on Ezekiel 38 and Ezekiel 39, I think some people were offended. We had a man from, I think he was from Croatia. He was in that area anyway. <laughs> near from Croatia, near Croatia. That was attending a couple of meetings and um, he, he left and uh, he was very nice about it, you know. But I think he left because he couldn't receive what I was preaching that the transmigrating soul of the Lord Jesus Christ is going to be incarnating in Japheth. And the way I was understanding it at that time, up, uh, actually up until this morning, the way I was understanding that translation of Ezekiel 38 was that the transmigrating soul of the Lord Jesus Christ, the transmigrating soul parts of the Lord Jesus Christ, would be incarnating only in Japheth. That was how I saw it, only in Japheth. But I don't see it that way anymore, okay? I see that the, the, reason, the reason that principle came out in Ezekiel 38, that the transmigrating souls of Jesus Christ will be incarnating in Japheth, is that the emphasis was that Japheth will be having its part in the salvation process because Jehovah was revealed to, to him okay, through uh, Nimrod, who I believe was good before he was evil, and Jehovah was revealed to Shem uh, through Abraham, and Jehovah did not have any direct contact with Japheth. So it's in the scripture that the transmigrating souls of the Lord Jesus Christ will be focusing on on transmigrating into the into Japheth because this is Japheth's day. This is his time. He has to get something from God. But it doesn't mean that they can't be transmigrating in other people's also. So I really thank God for this understanding today because it was even bothering me a little bit. It sounded a little too restrictive, you know. But that was the way I understood it at the time. And those two messages, those two chapters of Ezekiel 38 and 39, that was quite an effort bringing forth those translations. and. Uh, they're really exciting translations, but we work really hard bringing forth those translations. Mm -hmm. And uh, so nothing's perfect. There was that slight error at the time that the Lord's correcting now.